So wait, I think it was at home when Miss Jane was dropping projects on Benji. I'm thinking, do something very different, more clever crackery. Like musical learning. Yeah. Should we go with it? We'll see what Alright. Right. So if I play piano and you read from the book and yeah, yeah. This, this bit seems pretty informative. So. Alright. Benzene is a starting material for the synthesis of many aromatic materials. These chemicals include ethyl benzene, phenol, and styrene. Smaller quantities of benzene can be used to make a wide range of materials such as detergents, explosive pharmaceuticals, and dye stuffs. Benzene is a colourless liquid with a sweet odour. It is highly flammable and is formed in both natural processes and human activities. Natural sources of benzene include volcanoes and forest fires. Benzene is a component of crude oil, petrol, and cigarettes. Though, come with that, was that too quick to. Well, it's quite a lot there, Wayne. Like Greece, like benzene is aromatic, it's systematic. He was forced to stop by Michael Faraday in 1825, and he had an imperial performance of CH. He did, which is pretty jazzy. And then there was that IOL card. Oh, yeah, and he had an MR, he didn't have an MR, he discovered an MR of 78 for it, which means it must be C6H6. But then there was the structure, a bit of a problem. Yeah, they had a few proposed models, and none of them really worked, and then this guy called Kekule came along, and he proposed a model. I think we're missing something, right? I think we are. Beth said she wanted uh, a wrap, so is that chicken with mayo? Do you reckon she takes lettuce? Or? Oh, that'd be lovely. Do you work with like a wrap? Oh, so, the Snoop Dogg Little yeah, Wayne thing. Oh, they have hats, though. We do have hats. We have hats. Well, that's done, then we're doing a wrap. All right, not the one with chicken. Not the one with chicken, the other one. So... It's Ben in the house, and a zebra behind him. Story of Benzie. Hip hop rhyme, it was Frederick August. Hecule was trying it up in the benzene game. Yeah, he's gonna solve it. A dream, a snake, it was biting its tail. Lead him up on the benzene trail. Yeah! I'm gonna lose my hat as well. I think I can rap without the hat. So, you ready? The structure of benzene is a simple old thing. Six carbon, six hydrogens, it's not much to sing. He had three double bonds, and then the rest was all straight. The model seemed perfect, and he was like, Nate. The problem aroused, as they always do, it didn't react like it should on cue. Paul got good on Kirk, he had a solution. It just goes from one to the other, and it's all like, whoosh. A lady came along to join our song and said, Wayne, I don't think rap's our thing. She really said that? No, no, really, I, I don't think rap's our thing. Maybe go back to the... More songy thing. More songy thing? Yeah. It's possible. Okay, okay, we'll do, we'll do that. Okay, so, so what's next on the, the next page? We've got all this, and then we've got... Oh, we've got um, Kathleen Lonsdale. Oh. She was a chemist. She worked in London at about 1922, and she did something called crystallography. Now, you don't need to know the details of crystallography, but you need to know that she did that, and she proved about the shape. So, she did some stuff with it, didn't she? Yeah, she did. She There was one of the structure, and she found out what they were. So, using this, she had found that benzene was symmetrical. But that means that it couldn't be just double or single bonds because they are not the same length. So, what do they look like? Wayne, well, I think you might be a bit in trouble. Yeah. So, if it didn't have that, not double bonds or single bonds. has just one electron in the p orbital. So if you think about it, if there's six carbons, as was proved with the MR of 78, that if each of them donated to one of the electron in a pi bond, they'd each have one and a half bonds? Well, it might work then, I think. Well, you onto something. Yeah, I mean, there was actually a third problem, wasn't there, I recall? You're right, about Jordan loving butter. But Jordan loves butter, but you know doesn't tell anyone why. Yeah, I know what he does with it. Anyway, our scientists like butter as well. The hydrogenation, and they went, let's do a bit of Kekulé's model. Yeah, and it should work. It should, uh, the hydrogen should go break the double bond and form lots of hydrogens. And it did work, it but did. not quite. No, they did an energy profile diagram of what it should do. It just had much less energy, didn't they? In fact, 152 kilojoules per mole of energy had gone missing from the proposed model by Kekulé to what actually happened. That sort of the finally disproved completely Kekulé was a bit of an idiot. Yeah, I don't know that. So, back in the beginning.
beginning was Michael Faraday and Earl Hart. And then Kekulé showed up. He had a really good idea of what benzene should look like, but it wasn't right, was it? No, because Kekulé was so wrong, in fact, that we had to produce this massive song on how he was wrong and how we proved him wrong. And there's Kathleen Longsdale with crystallography, which is pretty good. And we discovered that benzene's it's just mental, it doesn't make any sense at all. It's got one and a half bonds. I mean, what's that about? No, it's like a hexagon shape, and it's shown with double bonds and single bonds, but it totally doesn't have either of those things. So we made this song for our chemistry class to teach you about benzene and all the stuff it does. This is the Clever Cracker Studio with the microphones and stuff and the jazzy piano, but it's not really our studio at all. No, it's just it's really the school. You get the main hall and you can go. That was that one. Yeah, yeah but anyway. we'll pretend it's our studio. This is our studio. And uh, the scene is crazy, and I think that's pretty much all. Yeah.